What's up guys, Cheetah here, and today I'm going to be showing you the collectible locations for the new map, Carillon Hamlet, that was just added in the new Chop Till You Drop update for Killing Floor 2, in order to get you the Hidden Globes achievement slash trophy. So starting off, I spawned outside in this area here, so that's where I'm going to be starting from, and the first collectible can be found on top of the Bell Tower Spire, right up here. And then from there, if you turn to your left and head through this broken doorway here, the second collectible will be just above it right here. And then from there, turn to your left and make your way up the staircase. And collectible number three is going to be on the pool table right here. And then from there, turn to your left and make your way into the bedroom. And collectible number four will be on the nightstand right here. And then from there again, turn to your left and follow this path. And collectible number 5 and 6 are going to be right next to each other. So number 5 can be found on the ledge here. And number 6 can be found just to the right of it on the pipes. Turn to your right and number 7 will be on the rooftop right here. Turn to your right and make your way up this little ramp and through the doorway in front of you. And then continue forward and turn right and you should see a metal gate in front of you. And collectible number 8 will be behind it on a little box right there and then from there if you turn to your left collectible number nine will be in the corner on top of these presents here and then if you turn to your left the final collectible will be on top of this train right here and once you collect the 10th one that'll unlock the hidden globes achievement slash trophy so that's it thank you guys for watching leave a like on the video if it was helpful and please consider subscribing for more guides just like this if you haven't already and i'll see you guys next time. I also want to give a special shout out to my Patreon supporters, ChanSpanG1 and TimG84, but other than that, thank you guys for watching.